Hi everyone, it's Heather. Um, ready for my random rant of the night because I I don't have anything planned <laughs> as usual. Um, so today I went to the car dealership uh, because I bought my Penelope about four months ago and I'm already bored of her. Four cylinders, they just don't do me. Uh, and so I, I got this, uh, I was testing out this 2009 Ford Fusion. I, I was liking it. It was like, you know, I've never owned a Ford before and blah, blah, blah. And uh, he's like, yeah, let's take it up this hill. And so there I am just driving away. And then I realized, see, it's, I'm going 10 miles over the speed limit. And to me, that's, I don't speed too often. So it's just like, uh, I'm breaking the law. <laughs> and so that makes me wonder, it's like, how often do these guys or girls, depending on salespeople, usually guys, um, how often do they go on test drives and the person driving the vehicle is like beating and they're just sitting there playing with their thumbs being like, should I say something or do I want to sell this car? <laughs> but, so I, I got to, I didn't, don't think I scared him. But I gotta drive a pretty car today. Didn't get it, but I gotta drive it. Made me feel good. <laughs> uh, I've been working a lot, um, especially at Ross. Been having a good old time there, and I realized something the other day. It's um, there's been a lot of guys in the shoe aisle, and not for the guys' shoes, may I say, in the women's shoes, looking at high heels, and maybe it's because like Valentine's Day is coming up or something, but. Why is it that so many guys without women around are shopping for women's shoes? And these guys will just walk up and down these aisles. They don't look confused. They are thoroughly looking at every shoe. Like, I don't know. It's just amazing. It's just like, damn. Since when have guys been so interested in which one has polka dots and which one's shiny? <laughs> so, so that's been spiking my interest lately. It's just making my mind wander a lot. Like this really large man, not like big wise. I mean, like football player large. Like this really buff, big guy. He, he came up to the checkout with this like size eleven pair of women's high heels, black and white polka dots, and I'm just wondering in my mind, did he pick these out for himself or? Does he have a larger woman at home? Larger as in big, tall, big feet. Not fat. But <laughs> it just makes me wonder. It's just like, man, there's a lot of fetishes around this time of year, isn't there? <laughs> oh. <laughs> but, um, yeah. Also, also, what's the deal with, like, just... When when you think of like shopping, you always think, oh, women, blah blah blah. I remember angry grocery shopping, good time. Um, that's what you call shopping for groceries when one person really hates to shop, and so you just make it fun for everyone. Call it angry grocery shopping and just play it out. <laughs> um, the guys have the reputation for hating to shop. I find that so untrue. There's just as many females out there as men that do not like to shop. And I know quite a few ladies that don't. But working at retail, I realize there are a lot of guys out there that really like to shop and know exactly what they want. Especially when it comes to jewelry. Like, I, uh, I work in jewelry department and I really like how people look at watches. I love watches. Now I have this thing for watches and makes me want to start a collection and be like, I like that one and that one. <laughs> but no, it's just watches, like, just by working there, I became a pro. It's just because the way they talk about them, like, the watch has a personality. And these guys teach me so much about shoes and watches and all this other stuff. It's just I've learned more from the men than I have the women, which is extremely odd. All I get from the women is, Hi, how are you? Are you having a good time tonight? I'm having a fucking great time! I'm looking at sheets and blankets and 
bath towels and shirts and these women just get excited about shopping to where men actually have a passion for what they're looking at and know what they're looking for. So this is where I say I'm sorry ladies, but the men are they have something going on that's definitely right. <laughs> uh I love working retail. <laughs> but um yeah, other than that other than work, um I got my hair cut. So I'm sporting a nice new haircut. Can't probably tell. Um new new eye brows too. I just I gave myself a makeover and I'm still working on that a little bit because um I hate getting sick and I got really sick, so so what do you do after you get sick? You wanna feel good. So what did I do? I gave myself a makeover. I went tanning today because living in the state of Washington you don't get a lot of sun. So going tanning just gives you a big boost. Just lifts your spirits. Um so <laughs> makeover for me. Um I'm not going blonde, I promise. <laughs> But everything's been fabulous and fan fantastic. I've kind of became addicted to Facebook and and I'm not gonna say like I almost said MySpace, but that was years ago. Don't worry about that. I'm not that crazy yet. Um Hulu <laughs> uh, I've been cleaning my house. Oh I definitely definitely um I'm getting situated here in my lovely trailer. <laughs> Um, I'm, I actually just started to realize that things are really starting to have their certain spot and get really organized here and just a little bit more so than normal. So I've been here for about five months and everything's really starting to fall in place. I'm starting to make it actual home instead of, hi, I just moved here, I'm new, and I'm actually getting um, situated and and knowing knowing where things are. I was driving the other day and and it was awesome. I found a shortcut all on my own without looking at my map and I was just like looking I'm like, you know, I'm pretty sure yeah, yeah, this is the street and that's the number and I'll just go this way and blah, blah. I felt so cool. Yeah, I, I know I wasn't really cool, but I felt cool. I'm finding my way around like a big girl. <laughs> So, um, yep, there's my random rant of the night. It's been too long since I've done videos. I've really got to get back into this. So I'm going to have to start finding time for this. Playing around, join myself. Alright, guys, I will see you next time. Bye!